I am so very excited uh, to be here tonight. And uh, I know what you must be thinking. His own show, Primetime. Why, there goes one confident dude. <laughs> but I'll tell you, this is a far cry from the first time I was ever on television, many, many years ago. I was 22 years old, a little nervous, shall we say, a tad heavier. Here we are, <laughs> on Earth together, it's you and me. Our love was made, it was made in heaven too. Let's have some stew, <laughs> you and me, you and me, me, you and me. <laughs> now right after that, I got into a very rigorous exercise program, which I maintain today. I, I, the secret for me is, is, is certainly abs. Now, it's not just abs. <laughs> But it's, it's, it's abs and stretching. And I think if you combine abs and stretching, you're on to something. It's kind of a bend down, bend down, feel the burn. You know, when I started, I could not reach this far. But what I think... <laughs> Did the dog just go behind me or... The days of wine and roses, I... I Pile it on, Gary. I can shake it, honey. I am, yeah. I am stuck yeah. by that. Good. So there's everyone back there. You're on my own. I am. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I, I'll always explain. I, you know, I, I'll always explain. Hi, Mom. You look pretty. Well, thank you, sweetie. You look kind of pretty yourself. You know what? Okay, you guys, listen. I want you to stay in here with Gary while I go out and upstage Daddy. <laughs> Gary, is that okay? You bet. Thanks, sweetie. We gotta get the dog. Hey, Gary. Yeah? Did you ever put makeup on Farrah Fawcett? You never heard that story? Mm -mm. Oh, boy. And as everyone knows, Farrah is a sucker for individual lashes. Well, up until that time, I'd only used them on John Forsythe. I knew they wouldn't work on Farrah. But then John has the eyes for them, doesn't he? And now, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce my two remarkably talented co-stars. Uh, one is the mother of my children, and the other is my wife. <laughs> I'm doing a bit again. Please welcome Alice Mnugin and Mrs. Meg Harper. Sure. Mom and Dad will let us keep him. They kept you. Give me your spy microphone. And put it under his collar. Then we'll be able to hear everything he's saying with the speaker. We have a very, very uh, exciting show for you tonight. Girls, we'll see you backstage. And we'll be right back after this. Every once in a while, a motion picture comes along that's so special, it almost makes you go completely mental. Oh, give me a break. This is too much. I couldn't be more excited. Being summoned to the Oval Office by the President of these United States of America, I must say. Just the thought of it is making me go completely mental. Damn, Case Rocker. How decent. Oh, and I suppose his back wasn't on fire with pain. What with the downing of PT-109, I must say. Talk about sad. Okay, where is he? My dear Mr. President, his name is Grimley. A perfect double. Hey, he's a good-looking stud. Can he talk? You can't shut him up. Talk to me, kid. Say something. Gee, those apple blossoms are pretty decent, I must say. All right. We'll just have him wave. No problem. <laughs> so, Mr. Grimley, 
Tonight you'll be taking my place at the presidential ball. Meanwhile, Miss Pearson and I will be having our own private ball in the Lincoln bedroom. <laughs> 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 oh, what? President, no. What's the matter? Is he okay? He was supposed to be president for a night. Now, he would be president for good. Starring Ed Grimley in the performance of a lifetime. <laughs> Mr. President! Are you in favor of quotas? Oh, yes. It's those darn half dollars that are problematic for me to <laughs> Interesting story. Walking along... President, President, are you looking forward to Camp David? Oh, yes, I am. I love camp. What, with the weenie roasts and the sing-alongs? hundred balls of beer on the wall. hundred... Mr. President, follow up to that question, President. sir. Filmed in Washington, D.C., where the real White House really is. Also starring Sally Field as the first lady who knew way more about things she didn't know that much about at all. She, she's a very decent fellow. Ah! How could you? How could you? Excuse me? Oh, don't patronize me. I'm not one of your little bimbos. Why I trouble you for a towel? I have put up with your sordid little affairs, but I will not put up with you cutting a single penny from my poverty programs. Turn around and face me when I'm talking to you. So, like, you feel that's absolutely necessary? Turn around and face me, Bob! No! <laughs> 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 From the director of The Crying Game. Not quite a president, not quite a first lady. Ed, coming to a theater near you. And if your license plate number is 039EYC, call within 30 seconds to win $100,000. That's right, call 555-2445 now, and that money is all yours. We're waiting, but you better hurry. There's only 20 seconds left. Call 555-2445 now. Hurry. Boy, 100 grand on the line, and only seconds left to claim it. Need a little more room in your jeans? Three, two, one, gone. Try Lee, the brand that fits. You may need a bigger TV to hold all this food. Introducing the Mega Meal from KFC. Everything from appetizers to dessert. With your choice of chicken, just $14.99. You can't even get two large pizzas for that. A lot of food, not a lot of money. You can't beat that. He never complains. He never says he's in pain. He says, I can handle it. But there are times when you can't handle it. When the pain lasts longer than the Tylenol. When you've tried the Advil. When aspirin upsets your stomach. That's when you say... Hey, there's nothing I can do. And see what your doctor recommends. Introducing Aleve, a non-prescription strength of Anaprox, a fast-acting form of the medicine in Naproxen, the number one selling brand in its class for 10 years. Only Aleve has 8 to 12 hour dosing. It lasts longer than extra strength Tylenol. Advil isn't stronger. Yet Aleve is gentler to your stomach lining than aspirin. New Aleve. There's nothing I wouldn't do for him. New Aleve. All day strong, all day long. In the future, man will create superhuman warriors. What if he can't control them? They're out for revenge. All human life will die. A fight for world domination. The two-hour movie premiere. Fire interstates. The new Sequest 9, 8 Central, NBC, Sunday. This is short. 30 seconds of a Sally Jesse sketch. Okay, Lucas. Hey, listen, I need wardrobe to get those red glasses to me, okay? Gotcha. Okay. Uh, listen, I, I moved your car closer to the stage door. Like, right next to the stage door. So as soon as you're done, you can just go right out the door and uh, drive away. Lucas, I didn't bring my car today. <laughs> I'm on it. <laughs> Sisters who steal their own sister's husbands. Today on Sally. Thank you to meet Stephen O'Day. On a perfect summer afternoon in 1974, he married the woman of his dreams, Adele O'Day. <laughs> For seven years, they lived together in wedded bliss until he 
fell in love with Denise O'Day, Adele's sister, <laughs> who had moved into their house not long after her own marriage had fallen apart. Adele, let's start with you. What's going on here? Okay, Stefan and I was living what they called the life of Delilah. <laughs> Everything was perfect, if not better. Then she comes along, Miss Heidi Ho, and stole what was rightfully mine. Lying through her teeth. I'm talking to Miss Sally Jesse, thank you very much. She's a liar and she knows it, Sally. Oh. Denise, Denise, let's give Adele a chance to tell her side and then I promise you'll have a chance to tell yours. Thank right. you, thank you. Go ahead, Adele. Thank you. Well, that, that's basically it, what I said. <laughs> Okay, Denise, <clears throat> your first marriage, it ended in divorce. Can you tell me what happened? Yes, Sally. Arnie was bad with liquor. His whole family's elky, so it runs in his family. It's genital. She was never home. Nothing. There's a stinking Oh, lie. you shut up. Okay, okay, my show, my show. <laughs> Okay, let's take some questions from the audience. Does anyone have a question? Right here. This one's for Stefan. Uh, which one are you living with now? Oh, well, uh, all three of us are still living together. Wow. Wow. Oh, boy. Wow. I have to say that I like to think of myself as being fairly liberal-minded, but that information simply blows my mind. Questions, 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 questions. Uh, my question is, Denise, you should rot in hell for what you've done. And Adele, how can you live with a guy that cheats on you? Let him get off scot-free. Well, it's it, it isn't easy, but it's it's because Stafford maintains he still loves me. That is a stinking lie. Oh, you shut up. He says he loves me. Tell her. Tell you her. Tell her I you love tell me. Tell her. Tell me. Tell anybody who listens. Sally, uh, some men need more than one woman. You know what I'm saying? His needs are fierce. I mean... Okay, we have time for for one more question. Who's got a question? Well, right here. Uh, this is to anyone. Um, I have some extra money I'm thinking of investing. Does anyone here recommend mutual funds? I'd stay away from them savings and the loan. I lost all my money with them crooks. You spent that money on yourself and you know that. It's a stinking lie. That's all the time we have for today. Please join me tomorrow when my topic will be romancing the pumps. What happens when your husband takes a shine to your shoes? I'm Sally Jesse. Peace. Uh, well, I'm off. Great show, everyone. See you Monday. Hey, wait a minute. Aren't you going to come to the party tomorrow night? Actually, I have a date. Bring him. Yeah, I don't think so. Well, why not? Well, you know, he wouldn't really fit in, and, and I'd be the brunt of everyone's jokes, and you'll be making fun of him, and... Oh! oh never! <laughs> never do never. that! That is a stinking run! <laughs> Come on. Well, I'll think about it. Good. Night! Good night, Good night, night. Sweetie. Okay, you guys, let's get this show on the road. Let's hey, go! Hey, Caroline. Look, I found your dog. Hey, that's the dog that ran across the stage tonight. Okay, before you get mad, let me explain. Uh-oh. Bye. Charlie and I found him in the street, and we didn't want him to get hit by a car, so we kept him. Well, honey, this dog obviously belongs to somebody. Look, he's got a, a tag here, right. and there's... Here, my name is Snowball Fortensky, and it's got a phone number. Fortensky? Isn't that Liz Taylor's married name? <laughs> Let's call the number. Let's try it. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> there's a definite uh, perfume smell. Uh -huh. His name Eddie Fisher. Mean anything. <laughs> Hello, Potensky residence. Uh, hello, is this Liz Taylor? The name is Elizabeth, and how did you get this number? 
Jeez. Yeah, I'm sorry, ma'am. Yes, yes. It, it's just that, that we found Snowball. Snowball! <laughs> no! <laughs> no, 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 no. Snowball's fine. Larry! <laughs> Larry! They found Snowball and he's alive! <laughs> ah! People don't do the gauntlet anymore. We are going to risk death a number of times on this trip. You're going to scream your guts out. You'll love it. Keep it hard! From the director of The Hand That Rocks the Cradle, Meryl Streep, Kevin Bacon. The River Wild, rated PG-13. Starts Friday, September 30th at theaters everywhere. The season premiere of The Fresh Prince. <laughs> Will's a big music mogul. Love you. And his top client is Ashley? Hillary's gotten real smart. If I were a potato, where would I be? Okay, maybe not. But oh, baby, is Nikki grown up? Cool! It's the all-new one-hour season premiere of The Fresh Prince, Monday on NBC. Ah, uh, are you kidding? Of course I was excited, Alice. I was at Elizabeth Taylor's house. Oh, she was, she was so nice. She just couldn't have been sweeter. Yeah, well, she was happy to get her dog back, you know, of course. I'll tell you about it tonight. All right, honey, bye. Hey! Hey, Mom, you said Miss Virginia was really nice. She was very nice. Well, do you think she'd give me back my spy microphone? What are, you, what are you talking about? Well, we put a microphone inside Snowball's collar, so when I turned this on, you can hear what he was doing. Larry! <laughs> The Domino's man! Get the coupons, you! Caroline, do you realize what you've done? You, you have violated this woman's privacy. This is very bad. We could get into trouble for this. I'm, I'm sorry, I just okay. forgot about okay, it. Okay, okay, it's okay, it's okay. I want you to just go up to your room, okay? And I'm gonna think about what we need to do. Go and finish your homework and I'll figure this out. <laughs> Marty! Marty, get out of here! Get in here, quick! Get out of the pool! Get in here! Oh. 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 This better be important. Marty, you are not going to believe what the kids did. What? They put a microphone on Elizabeth Taylor's dog, and you can hear everything that they say in that house. Listen. <laughs> Lay off the pepperoni, Potensky. <laughs> this hat is mine and you know it. Oh, Queenie likes. <laughs> Your sense is actually... Yes, yes. It's like a gift from God. Sorry, Muffin, did I hurt your feelings? Come over here and give Mommy a big sloppy kiss. <laughs> I want a big sloppy kiss. Kiss! <laughs> no, honey, we, we can't do this. This is what, an eavesdropping. What are you talking about, it's eavesdropping? Oh, how would you feel if, if someone was listening to us? Okay? Oh, come on. Let it Marty, go. That's no, what no, I, no, I... no, no, we can't do it. We can't do it. Fine. It's against the law. It's illegal. Okay, let it fine, go. fine. Think, think about this. I mean, I'm shocked at your attitude. Really? All right, we'll listen to it one more time. <laughs> and then that's it. Look at this. Every channel. Nothing but garbage on television. Oh, Larry, look! American Gladiators is on! Go, Nitro, go! <laughs> okay. All right. That's it. Finished. Oh. Wow. Okay. Wow. Okay, you know, do you know, she likes Nitro, we like Nitro. Is that here? Oh, I know. It really gets you thinking. Now drop it. Let's go. <laughs> It's Alice, and you're not going to believe who her date is, Lucas! I know what you're thinking, but in his own way, he is a very intelligent young man. Lucas, mm. would you mind getting the two of us a drink? Can we each have one? Sure. <laughs> yeah, here you go. I'm not saying it's long term. You remember, Lucas? Hi, guys. Hey, Marty. Just putting the kids to bed. 
was Meg. And there we were, naked as jaybirds. Oh, hey! Hi. D did you get the kids in bed? Yes. Oh, that's yes, great. Yes, that's yes, just yes, great. Well, I knew you'd be pleased. Yes, I'm in the kitchen. <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> just a quick question. Yeah. What, what's behind your back? Marty, have I ever told you that I think your characters are absolutely brilliant? Ooh, are you pathetic. Oh, please. You would have done the same thing if you had the chance. I've had plenty of chances. And did you see me in here? I don't think I've been in here. I have been in there entertaining our guests. Oh, please, you can't tell this. We, we, it's driving you crazy. It's got to be of driving you crazy. Of course it's driving me crazy. But I'm not going to listen to it because it is morally unacceptable. Oh. Uh, just give me the... No, me I'm the, not... No, me. no! I'm just having a little fun. I'm not hurting anybody. No. What are you doing? I'm working out? <laughs> ah, ah, just give me the... Thank you very much. I don't know. I don't. Now, we have guests in there, yes. Missy. Remember that? Yes. Now, I suggest you go up there, you put on a little apron, or do what a hostess does, and do it. Okay. Thank you. Okay, you're All right. right. You're All right. right. You All know right. what? I can do it. I'm sure you can. Because I'm strong. <laughs> I'm strong. I'm strong. Are you sure it's wrong? I'm weak. I'm weak. I'm weak. Oh, where is it? Where's the speaker? Oh, you're really here to listen to this. Get away a second. Okay, yeah, okay yeah. so we're gonna. Okay. You're gonna listen to this once. Yeah. That's it. Never listen to it again. You understand? Okay. okay. All right. Ready? Yeah. Okay, hurry. Turn Violet contact lenses are killing me. <laughs> when can I end this charade and let my public see the brown eyes God gave me? <laughs> I knew it. I knew that wasn't her natural color. Uh, what's this? Oh, dear sweet Mary, it's a microphone. <laughs> Larry! We've been bugged. <laughs> and I think I know who it was. Are you listening, Mr. and Mrs. Short? You're in big trouble. I'm gonna bust your chops. Nice party, kids. Thanks for having us. Whoa, it's late. We gotta go. Thanks. Well, it's 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 obvious what we have to do. I mean, we just we we just have to go over there and and just apologize face to face. Yeah, you're absolutely right. And, and will you do me a favor? W when you get back, would you wake me up? No matter how late it is, I'm dying to see how this thing goes. Come on. Well, I guess a little peace offering couldn't hurt. <laughs> you were at Elizabeth Taylor's house till four in the morning playing Twister. I, I'll tell you, she was surprisingly agile. Mm. Oh, unbelievable. I mean, Larry, Larry, I mean, I, I swear there is not a show tune written that that guy doesn't know. Unbelievable. Very cool couple. Oh, wow. and, and so understanding about the whole microphone thing. Yeah. You know, once I blamed it all on the kids. There was yeah. a moment. Mom, was... look, it's a present from Elizabeth Taylor. Can uh, open it? Oh, oh you're cute. Oh, I love thing. this woman. She's very nice. Look at this. Look at... Oh, oh, look at this! A dog! Oh, it's a dog! It's a dog! Oh, look, Daddy! Look at him. The dog is the same color as your hairpiece! <laughs> oh! oh no, 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 honey, honey. Uh -huh. no, 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 that's Daddy's secret. Yes, no, that's something that we can think about, but we can never actually say out that's loud, remember? <laughs> you can't see me betting, can you? Oh, not today. Boy, you had better believe we've turned the tables on them this time for Tensky. I'm gonna be on him like pure Canadian maple syrup on on pancakes. <laughs> I hear Garth Brooks is in the building today. <gasps> oh, I just got a CD at McDonald's. Oh. Oh. It's Garth's favorites. Oh, it's gotten much too young and wild. Oh, how's that one go? Yeah. Oh, the white line. I puts on a cowboy hat and he thinks he's Garth Brooks. Get Garth's <laughs> favorites. Each full length CD is just $5.99. Each cassette $3.99 when you buy any extra value meal or large sandwich. Or get these other hot artists. $1 from each CD and cassette benefits Ronald McDonald Children's Charities. Why just moisturize your hair when you can go all the way to healthy, shiny? Pantene Pro V has a pro vitamin formula that penetrates, improving hair all the way to the tips. 
for hair so healthy it shines. More than moisture, Pro Vitamins. So while you're writing legal briefs, which batteries run your baby monitor? Um, Duracell. They last long. And uh, I assume that's your honest, candid opinion as both a mother and attorney, huh? Fair and accurate and voluntary representation. Duracell. No other battery lasts longer. Your witness. Oh, look at the sunset. It's like being in the islands. So is this. Mm. New Kahlua Cafe from General Foods International Coffees. Mmm. Delicious. What's this flavor? Kahlua? I'm imagining tropical breezes. And endless beaches. The only after-dinner coffee with the flavor of real Kahlua. It makes me want to be... Where? Right here, right now. Celebrate the moments of your life. New Kahlua Cafe. Tuesday in NBC premiere. Okay, Tuesday night, the Martin Short premiere. Now, take a wild and crazy guess who shows up this week. We don't know. Come on, you know him. Martin's amigo. I've been a fan of yours for so long. And he's putting the moves on Martin's wife? Oh! The Martin Short premiere, Tuesday after Wings on NBC. Next, another Seinfeld. Holy cow! Followed by Frazier, winner of five Emmys. <laughs> then, Melissa Gilbert and Cicely Tyson in Sweet Justice. All NBC Tonight. I got the blues, but up above it's so fair. Shoes go on and carry me there. I'll build a stairway to paradise with a new step every day. Seinfeld tonight after the presidential address. Sarah's waited 10 years for this lake house. We're in 